Hello there gamers, how's everyone doing on this wonderful day today? Hope you guys are all doing great. Uh, I see that they have just announced the fire sale that's going to be happening tomorrow by the first, you know, the first looks of it. It's looking like bee skins. I don't really know. 10 bee skins. That red one looks actually really nice right there. I'm not sure how much I like these other ones, but I actually am a really big fan of that one. That one looks really cool. I think that might be a flipping hit right there. 1500 quantity is relatively on the low side. Yeah, I don't really know how appealing they're like this. This blue one's kind of nice right here. Yeah, I have a feeling people are gonna like that. I really like that red one though. Wow. Uh, also, I saw that there was something else insane that happened today. Super, super crazy. Wait till you guys see it. It is the super crafting update. Long awaited. We've been waiting for this one for a long time. You can now super craft items from your, your sack and, you know, such ender chests and backpacks, you know, which to be fair is actually pretty cool. You know, or like I'm obviously being like partially sarcastic because it's, it's, it's kind of ridiculous but you know at the same time though it is actually quite cool uh, it'd be cool if we got like you know a major update they added the more options for quick crafting this is pretty cool as well you know it's just a quality of life stuff i mean it's nothing crazy what you would do is you do such recipe terminator and then you click right here and then bang you can click the super craft button and assuming you have all that stuff it'll just insta craft it so you don't have to go around and like gather all this up together it just it just insta crafts like this and then i also have this thing turned on too because i assume that blc will probably update this side menu here that shows every item in the game so that if you wanted to craft like a mosquito bow, which I don't know why you would do that, but you would click this right here and then it would probably prompt um, this same looking thing instead of opening up this custom menu. And then it'll allow you to super craft it, which I think actually will be pretty cool because because this menu right now is not really all that useful. It's a, it's not really anything insane. Obviously, it's just like, you know, quick crafting basically, but it's cool. Nonetheless, I'm making bank from Kudra. Yeah, I should do a video about that, right? People saying that they're making like 150 mil an hour, some crazy nonsense like that doing Kudra. We should do a video about that at some point but not today though we're on the other profile the non-contraband profile i'm nicked but what level am i on here again you know 175 i have this golden dragon that we purchased you know previously i think we're like rich too uh i definitely have like a lot of starfell that hasn't been sold so like i know that i have a lot of money there and then what's really gonna be crazy is when i collect those slime minions because i know those are gonna be flipping nuts it must be like one or two months since i collected these so how much is that Oh my God, seven, five times 25. Yeah, that's a bank. That is a lot of money. I want to do M5 because master stars are so much money. And I think that I have adequate gear to do M5. If I don't have adequate gear, I could probably, you know, spend a little bit more. Okay, we're rich. Um, very rich, 400 million coins. Wow. So these are not as expensive as they were when I made the last video, but it's still like ridiculous, right? When I uploaded the video, I think the star, the, the uh, these power crystals were like 900K, 950. Now they're like 820. So like when I uploaded the video it made like 20 mil an hour now it'll probably make like 18 mil an hour which is still like insane right if it made 20 and now it only makes like 18 it's still like a ton what else do i need for m5 is this acceptable because we could do it and find out i mean if i can't solo a mini boss then it's probably unacceptable right Okay, so right, if the M4 mini boss is that easy, I, I feel like we're gonna be doing just fine on M5. You said RNG Mineral Star? No. 55 million. What does it cost in the chest? 7 mil, actually. Oh my god. Holy, bro. 48 million coins profit from getting one single Master Star. Yeah, Shadow Fury and Chest Plates both profit too, right? Is he gonna kill me? No, bruh. Okay, so am I like really, really, really good? Or, or did he carry all the damage right there? That guy's a tank, so I must have done a, a lot of that. But he is like Catacombs 50 though. Don't trust everything you hear on the internet. Yeah, what's that? The the Abraham Lincoln quote? He was a flipping real one for saying that. What was it all cut? The frick happened to the other half of it? Don't believe everything you read on the internet just because there's a picture with a quote next to it. Abraham Lincoln. Uh, okay, cool. Yeah, I mean, that's it. I feel like it's not bad. I'm not in the craziest gear. I don't have a level 200 gold dragon. Like, I feel like if I were to do M6, I would really, really be pushing it. But I feel like my gear is, you know, more than adequate enough to do uh, M5 if I can, you know, kill Shadow Assassins like that. What the frick? Where did bro get that from? He's got a, a black sheepy sitting there in his inventory. What is he doing with that? This dude knows. This is These are such a good buy. Because those always go through phases where they pop off. Another warp stone. Wow. Back to back. Um... Okay, well, like, technically, I guess it's profit. 
What? We're rich, bro. 10 mil. I didn't take the last one. I got, is that actually going to sell? Are, are they really worth that much money? I don't believe that. I don't think so, right? You can import export uh, waypoints to be able to see now. Yeah, I saw. Um, How does it actually work? How Do you import it from like the, 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 the places where people have it? Like the other ones, chat trigger waypoints or something like that? Copy this. Go to the waypoint mob. Press import. Import. Was oh, that it? Just because I had it copied? Yeah. Whoa, what the frick? Holy. So it does the, the tracer until you get to it. And then it updates to the next one. So which is like extremely nice for gemstone mining. And it hides them too until you actually would want to see them. Right. It only shows you the next and the one that you were already at because it's super, super annoying to see all the waypoints because it's like really scuffed when they're in one area, like clustered like that. That is so, so nice. Uh, BLC is amazing. That's going to be a buy right there. You know, you know, you know, you know. No, like every single run almost every single run is like a profit chance so but like we need like something crazy though a star a, a star and it kind of like throws everything off a couple lucky stars and it really it's really nuts uh stock of songs what are these at oh nice man motherfucker what on earth okay but i think that it's so thinly traded of all the people looking to buy stock of songs they're they're only looking to purchase 383 of them so like if you were to insta sell just like one stack I mean, you, you dump the price by like, you know, millions of coins instantly by selling one stack. It'll fall all the way down to 28. It'll fall 2 million by selling one stack. Oh, which I think somebody literally just did. What the, the frick just happened? Uh, it just fell 2 million, right? Right as I was saying it. Okay. It's not the correct chain of items that I meant to click right there. Don't you do it. Direct. Now that I'm using the Yeti pen, he doesn't one tap. Before he would one tap. Same with this guy as well. See that? That one hit would have been a one tap, but I use slipping a Yeti now. Before I was using Golden Dragon, and I get one tapped by all of them. And now I do like a little bit less damage, but I don't get one tapped anymore. If you play Mage on M5, you'll you'll probably be able to find parties so so easily. That's what we always end up waiting for. They need a Mage. They need a Mage. Uh, these guys have a Mage, but he's 31, and this this party needs a Mage. All of us need Mages, or four of the five parties are waiting for Mages. What does an LCM setup look like? What was the um, what is this guy using right here? Yeah, but LCM is expensive. Is it really define expensive what do you need okay so it's a claymore full storm and gold dragon is it really that expensive because i'm using a terminator which is like the same as a claymore isn't it once you put all the notes way 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 cheaper right these are really cheap you gotta put some nice enchants on there for sure but but it is m5 you don't need a 10 bill setup to do m5 want to play m5 i do want to play m5 i played some m5 off stream i did like 20 dungeon runs and you know i mean i haven't gotten a master star which is the you know the really really crazy part about doing m5 because you know it's just so much profit you you, you profit more than 50 million coins by getting one single master star from the chest in m5 i've done three days of m5 i wish i kept track of how many runs total maybe like 50 60 runs uh 70 runs total that we've done recently and i haven't gotten one but to be fair though i made a lot of money from all the other random stuff because legion books are 2 million coins you know recoms are 7.8 mil and i sold one of these warp stones for 15 mil probably making like a million coins a run on average i'd really like to think that the you know the time that it's taken for this forging update to come out you know the fact that it's been a long time is because they're setting up the game to move over the current islands to the newest version of minecraft i'd like to think that they're setting up the framework so that it'll be easy then in the future and it'll be quicker to do new islands on the new version right so be because like none of this framework was there before that allows the game to go back and forth between 1.8 and 1.20 which is what the fortune island is going to be so i'd like to think that that it's taken so long because they had to set up that entire environment to make that possible so not only did they have to create the entire update but they had to make it so that it actually worked with the you know the current version of the game so then maybe the updates to come are going to be much quicker because now they have the infrastructure so i need to figure out for the next video like a budget lcm setup and then i'll give that away in the video and then i show off like max lcm setup i could even go crazy and buy the second claymore and all that stuff as well that's definitely a possibility I got one bill for my minions i quit a year ago do you want it i mean if you're gonna play again you should like keep it for sure i don't like taking stuff from people if they still play or might still play i only take items from people who are like i'm clicking the disconnect button and i'm never ever ever gonna join again every single chest is profit i wish there was a master star on one of these though i won't play again what the frick wait i thought it wasn't it 1B? What the heck? That's way more than 1B. And 1B! What the frick is this? We're rich! 3B? 
Oh, shoot. I forgot. Uh, you can bid it on my auction house. One sec. I'll put something at my auction here. I will sell you the most expensive present stack ever sold in the history of Hypixel Skyblock. Thanks, man. Sorry to see you go. Thank you for giving me all your stuff, though, man. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you, buddy. I wonder if Hyperion's will go up because of the forging update. I bet you that the forging update is going to be like the mining update and, and it's going to be like the, like the garden update. And I bet you that they're going to overshoot and it's going to make too much money and then they're going to have to backtrack. And But they won't do it fast enough and it'll cause inflation exactly like what happened with the last two money maker updates they overshot on the crystal hollows and they had to nerf the gemstone sell price by like 50 percent uh and then they overshot on the farming update and they had to nerf it by like 40 50 percent or something like that right so i bet you they're going to overshoot again and it's going to cause inflation and i bet you it's going to cause hyperions to go up a lot and like literally everything still the best investment is probably skins any skin that's more than two years old basically a re any skin that's older than the ammonites anything older than the ammonite skins is, is probably like all but guaranteed that you'll make money buying those as long as you don't overpay for them i'm listening 28 recoms that's good too for sure yeah 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 yeah. recoms almost always go up during new updates because there's going to be so much stuff that like you know there'll be new talisman there'll be new tools there'll be new armor sets all of them will need to be recoms recoms almost always go up speaking of that's a really 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 nice chest ah yes oh my gosh in the same run too this is probably the, like the best chest i've seen and then this one as well oh my gosh the first one i mean it took it took quite a few runs I, I i wasn't exactly keeping track of you know how many that took since you know within this recent grouping but i mean it's it's probably 100 at least 100 maybe like 110 120 so technically speaking i think i got a little tiny bit rng carried but i don't think so because i think the drop rate's 140 i mean like i don't have an exact total profit number but i mean like m5's good because like that thing's going to be 60 mil i have 30 mil sitting there this is going to be a bunch and then i already collected like a full bazaar the other day too it's a good catacombs xp the gear requirement to do it is not like outrageous like i'm in like three master star armor like you could do it with two i have a terminator bow you like you do kind of need these two things if you're gonna play as berserker archer